Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm so proud of myself for filming this today, you have no idea. It's absolutely roasting in the flat at the moment and um, I, it's been a struggle changing into all the outfits but I did it and here we are. I'm also back at it again with the chocolate Oatly. Um, yeah, it's pretty much getting me through the hot weather, it's absolutely amazing. I cannot believe that I've only just discovered chocolate oat milk and it has become like my new obsession. I absolutely love it. Right, so one of the most requested things I get asked to do on YouTube or on Instagram is styling shorts for mid-sized gals and I say this every time but I totally get why I am 5 foot 2 and around a size 10 to 12 and shorts are the bane of my life in the summer. Um, once I find a pair of shorts that fit perfectly I hold on to them and I style them with whatever I can find. I feel like it's a really holy grail type item for me. I feel like I could try on every pair of shorts in a shop and only find one pair that looks okay on me. So now that I've found my perfect pair of denim shorts which I'm actually wearing, I thought I would come on here and style them five ways for you guys. Just to show you how I, like a mid-size figure, also petite, but um, this is mostly going to be catered towards like mid-size styling because like height doesn't really matter because shorts are short. So I thought I would do some styling for you guys just to show you guys how I'm going to wear these throughout the summer. Now that I have found these shorts and I have another paper bag waist pair of shorts that I have from New Look, I'll add like an insert here if I have one from a previous styling video. I absolutely love those as well. I'll leave the links for both of these below. So yeah, I'm going to style these and that pair of shorts from New Look this way for the whole of summer. I am really obsessed with the longer style short. Not necessarily the one that's like down to your knee. I don't think I can get away with that because I am petite, but I love these. They've got like an extra inch of length. So yeah, I love these. They're from Topshop. I got them in a size 12 and I would say they are quite roomy on me around the waist. Like I have got like a good like inch on the waist but I know if I'd have sized down, they would no way have fit my bum and my thighs. So there is the option to like belt them up, but I prefer denim shorts looking a bit oversized without belting them. So it doesn't really bother me that much. I also find them more comfortable like when I sit down and all the rolls come out and stuff like that, it all fits a little bit better. And I would personally say if you're a mid-sized girl looking to buy shorts for the first time or you're, you're only getting brave enough to try denim shorts or you know, whatever you're trying out, order more than one size because I am a 10 to 12 so I sit right in the middle and I feel like if I had ordered these in a 10 they would definitely have been too tight I would have felt pretty crappy about myself and then sent them back and I wouldn't have reordered them but it's not about size it's about fit so I have a lot of room in these but I love the fit and I love that kind of baggy more androgynous feel to the short as opposed to them being like really short hot pants right okay I think we're ready let's get styling so the first outfit I've got to share with you guys is one I've actually worn twice already with this warm weather. I got this bodysuit from Primark quite a while ago. It was super inexpensive and it looks so nice. Alex always compliments me when I wear this and I do feel like it looks more than it actually cost. It looks great. I'll link some similar ones down below but this one's from Primark. And I've also started it with my fave lightweight cardi. I've got to have a lightweight cardi for summer. This one is just from New Look. I really like the fact that it's lightweight and it's also got that really fine knit look. I absolutely love that. Because the rest of the outfit is very monochrome, keeping it simple, you can definitely get away with throwing on a hat. I think it adds a little edge to the outfit. It's really cute and obviously I've paired this with my high top converse. I absolutely love these. They're the ones with the little platform around the bottom. And I love them for adding a little bit of height. I'm five foot two, so any extra inches in height I can get, I will take, even if it's with a flat form sole. So I absolutely love these Converse for that. I think the whole look is really edgy and cute. I also find this outfit so comfortable. If you're one for comfort, this is a great one for you. If bodysuits aren't your thing, you could totally swap it out for like a little cami top. That's fine too. I just really like the the combo of the cardi, the stripes, the converse and the hat, I think it is a really cute little look. Obviously, I had to style these shorts with a bam tee because these shorts give me some real LA vibes. I love the length on these shorts, they're just a little bit baggy, just a little bit more androgynous and I really, really like that more boxy loose fit as opposed to the tight style hot pant denim shorts, if you know what I mean. So I've gone ahead and styled this with my favourite band tee ever, it's my Nirvana band tee, it's so worn and I love it, it's from Urban Outfitters, I'll link some similar ones below but I got this one about two years ago and I still absolutely love it. 
I've also thrown on a cute little bag. This one is from New Look. It's just like a really slouchy, comfortable bag. I feel like this outfit needs something to like soften the look and this is so slouchy and delicate. I love it. So I've also gone ahead and styled this outfit with a pair of boots with studs. I absolutely love styling band tees and big chunky boots. I absolutely love the look. It's so street style and I think it's a really edgy look that's very easy to do. It's literally a oversized tee, a pair of shorts and some boots, but for some reason it looks really cute. I absolutely love, love, love this look. So I've also changed up my hair. I've done it in a half up, half down sort of hairstyle and I've also got my trusted pair of Ray-Ban Octagonal Sunnies, they're my faves, and I think it really completes the look. I love this one for, again, it's so comfortable, but it's also got that really nice edge to it. Next up, we have something a little bit more feminine. I absolutely love this top. It's from Monkey, and it just arrived in the mail. It is just this beautiful white blouse that you tie up the front. The tie is totally up to you, so you can do it as tight or as loose as you need it. I'm wearing a size medium and it fits the girls in pretty nicely. I've also teamed it with a pouch bag. This one's from New Look and I've tied it up myself just to make it a little bit shorter so it's more like a shoulder bag than a crossbody bag. And I just love the kind of cute femininity that all the whites are bringing. I've also styled it with a pair of, yes, you guessed it, white sandals. These ones are from H&M. And I just think adding white to denim really gives an outfit a really airy, light, feminine look. And I just think this is a really, really cute little outfit. Again, keeping that comfort there. The shoes are comfortable, the top is comfortable. Everything's very breathable. And this is definitely an outfit I will be wearing for a little girly look in spring, summer. Next up, I had to star my new tie-dye tee. I've mentioned it a few videos before, but I love this tie-dye tee. It's from Nasty Gal. It's like a pastel, cute little tie-dye tee. And I think it is the perfect thing to style with some denim shorts. The whole look is very something I would have worn when I was like, what, like 12 or 13? And I absolutely love that. It's so nostalgic. And I've also thrown on that slouchy bag from New Look again, just because I feel like the neutrals really match in with the pastel in the top. Don't want to overdo it on colour, so I kept everything else neutral. And I think this look is the funnest one out of the bunch. It's so fun and bright. If you're more into your colour, this one is really good for you. Adding tie dye with denim just as this vintage retro look and I think it's an absolute winner for this spring summer. Next up I've taken a top that I've again owned for a few years. It's this cami top that ties up at the back. It's got a high neckline with a tie up the back but instead of tying up the back I've gone ahead and tied it up at the front. It's a fun way of reworking an old top because I've seen a lot of trends these days where tops tie up at the front and hang down. So I thought I would style this golden oldie like that because I've worn it tied up at the back for, for so many years and I think it looks so cute tied up at the front. Gives the piece a new lease of life. I've also gone ahead and styled this again with my Converse and with the bum bag just to add a little bit of edge. This outfit is all about the top. It's all about that tie at the front. So I didn't want to detract from the main focal point, which is the little tie at the front. I think it just adds so much edge and flair. I think this outfit is a really nice balance between feminine and androgynous. I think that it looks really edgy and cute all at the same time. I cannot wait to wear this one in spring, summer. I'm gonna get so much wear out of this outfit because it's so so, so easy to wear and it's comfortable. So those are my five ways to style denim shorts for spring summer. I hope you guys enjoyed. I absolutely love these shorts. I, I even think this is a cute outfit, but I can't wait to wear them for the whole of spring summer. I am obsessed with the fit. I love the rips down the side and they were a really good investment piece for me. So I just wanted to show you guys a few different ways to style denim shorts if you're a mid-size figure like myself and you're a little bit unsure about how to style shorts or short denim. You could also do any of these styles with a denim skirt as well. I think that would look equally as cute. So I hope that's helped some of you guys to think of new creative ways to style your denim shorts and to feel a little bit more confident in them. If you liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.